My name's Stuart Smith. I'm Clinical Associate Professor in Neurosurgery and Honorary Consultant Neurosurgeon at Nottingham University Hospitals and the University of Nottingham. My lab works within the Children's Brain Tumour Research Centre at the uh, University of Nottingham. My group particularly focuses on um, tumours called gliomas or astrocytomas and we have a particular focus on the high-grade aggressive versions of those tumours. So the project funded by the Brain Tumour Charity will, uh, is funded for one year. It will focus on uh, adult uh, glioblastoma. One of the big problems with glioblastoma is it's an extremely invasive tumour. What we can see on the scan is really just the tip of the iceberg in that the area that's sort of pure tumour in the core, um, which we can remove surgically, is surrounded by an area of uh, apparently normal brain that actually contains significant populations of, of tumour cells that have invaded in. So using a, a medicine we give to patients, this medicine makes tumour cells glow bright pink, which makes it easier to identify at surgery, allowing us to surgically remove more of them, but also allows us to sort the pink cells from the blue cells, even if they're mixed together after surgery. And that allows us to conduct experiments specifically on the, the cells that glow pink, i.e. the cancer cells, and hopefully allows us to more accurately characterise them and develop better treatments for them. We've successfully been able to um, establish the method for extracting these fluorescent cells from within the mixed population and, and to extract the, the cancer cells from within the, the normal brain. Um, we've begun very preliminary studies to show they are different to the bulk of the tumour upon which uh, most previous studies have been, have been conducted. You know, we're building on previous work by other groups and building on our own work. We're confident that we can extract these cells and that they are special and different and warrants this, this particular study. So we think this project is really important because we are targeting the actual cell population that goes on to cause tumour recurrence um, and I think it gives hope that we can finally begin to extract that information from a difficult environment from within normal brain cells uh, and develop treatments that target the cancer and we would hope clearly to be able to move this forward to clinical trials and to patient benefit as, as swiftly as possible.